So, you might be wondering how to exactly fix if Fortnite is freezing on your PC. Well, there are a few things that you may want to do here. Now, I'm assuming here that you already checked uh, what's the requirements for you to run Fortnite and you already did or you did update your graphic settings in game here, but still uh, it doesn't help. Well, there are other things that you could try doing here. Again, do the basic stuff first, but once you've done that, updated your graphic settings or whatnot, it's still help, not helping. Well, in this case, this is what you need to do. Now, first things first is you want to make sure that your GPU is fully updated. Now, depending on what you're currently using, it may be AMD or NVIDIA, depends on your GPU. You want to make sure that you download the driver for it. So in my case, I have the NVIDIA app installed in my PC. Now, if you don't, if you have an AMD, go install the AMD one. But yeah, in the NVIDIA app, you want to go to drivers here and you want to make sure that you install the current up the, uh, update. For it sometimes if you don't have the updated version that could cause a lot of issues so make sure to update it now the next thing that you want to do here is you may want to check a few things so in this case you want to go ahead and make sure that whenever you're running your pc you're using uh, the minimum amount of resources so what i mean by resources here that includes if uh, running apps or background apps here like for example if you're playing fortnite in the background you may want to close other apps because uh fortnite is free uh is resource heavy it takes a lot of resources so in this case you want to press on your keyboard control shift escape and in here what we need to do is you want to go ahead and basically look for any apps that you're not using so i would recommend you to close any browser so if you you are using multiple browsers go ahead and close every browser now close other games that you currently have running or and also close any apps that again you're not using so to filter them out you're going to just click on memory here and this will organize everything here so which consumes a lot of memory so in this case since i'm not using steam you can go and just right click on it click on end task and do this for all apps that you're not currently using and you will notice a big improvement inside the game itself also you may want to adjust how your game or your pc starts up so you want to go to startups and from here you want to go and look for apps that you don't want to start up so for example if you're not using spotify right click on it and just use, use the disable button here so just in case every time you open up your pc it's not going to bloat your pc and it's not going to slow down whenever you're playing some games and yeah, and the final thing that you try doing here is whenever you're trying to launch Fortnite, you may want to add a very specific, uh, in this case, code on it. So what you need to do is you want to go and click on the uh, profile at the top right here. Click on settings. Now scroll down over here. Look for Fortnite. Expand this one. And you want to make sure, make sure that you add the following. So it's going to be dash use all available course. Once you've added that, you can go ahead and go back. Now I would recommend you to restart epic games here once you restart that go ahead and run fortnite and see if that helps but well, that's about it so hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to our channel thank you for watching